gangster Vikas Dubby, who met with a gory end in an encounter with the UP STF near here on Friday, conjured the image of a typical Don who dabbled in real estate, won a district-level election and rubbed shoulders with political figures. Last Friday, Dubby, who was around 50 years old, hogged the headlines after his henchman allegedly shot dead eight police personnel in a botched raid that he had converted into an ambush. Also read, criminal has gone, but what about those protecting him? Priyanka Gandhi on Vikas Dubby's encounter killing an old photo on social media showed him at an event next to an Uttar Pradesh minister, who switched parties to join the ruling BJP. Congress claimed this showed his political patronage. Another picture showed a poster of him appealing for votes for his wife, Richa Dubby, in a Zilla Panchayat election which she won from Gamau under which Bikru village falls. The poster also carried pictures of two leaders now in the opposition, implying that she had their support. In 2000, Dubby himself won the Shivrajpur seat in a Zilla Panchayat poll he fought from prison, where he was lodged after a murder charge, according to officials. However, following his arrest on Thursday, Dubby's mother Sarla Devi said, at this time, he is not in the BJP, he is with the SP. Also read, Kanpur police murders, was Vikas Dubby arrested, or did he surrender? But, a Samajwadi party spokesman said Dubby was not a member of the party and strict action should be taken against him. Moreover, his call record details should be made public as demanded by party president Akhilesh Yadav to expose his links, he said. After being on the run for nearly a week, during which he was said to have taken refuge in a hotel in Faridabad on Delhi's outskirts, Dubby was picked up from the holy city of Ujjain in Madhya Pradesh on Thursday. MP Home Minister Naradam Mishra said on Thursday, Dubby arrived at the Mahakal Temple in his car. A police constable identified him first, after which three others security personnel were alerted and he was taken aside for questioning and later arrested. Also read, all you need to know about up gangster Vikas Dubby however, temple sources gave a slightly different account. They said Dubby reached the temple gate in the morning and purchased a 250 rupees ticket from a counter near the police post. When he went to a nearby shop to buy prasad for the deity, the shop owner identified him and alerted police, they added. When policemen asked him his name, he loudly said, I am Vikas Dubby of Kanpur, following which the cops and private security personnel deployed at the temple nabbed him. The MP police then handed him over to the UP police. When he was being brought to the state, the police vehicle carrying him from Ujjain overturned at Bauti area in Kanpur on Friday morning, police claimed.